Well, Deborah, this shopping center has stores, restaurants, even apartments. Residents say kids play here all the time and witnesses say yesterday afternoon a little boy was riding his bike when he and his mom were hit with a stray bullet. Some lady walked in with ran inside with a kid in her hands. She said I've been shot. I've been shot. A 43 year old woman shot her four year old son with a bullet fragment in his arm. Police say they were caught in the crossfire at the Wild Lake Village Center in Columbia Sunday afternoon. Workers at the Pizza Bowlies, who did not want to be identified, heard the shots and came to their aid. Yeah, we were just scared. Oh, that was the first thing. Just, we never seen something like this happen. First thing was just to get her in the back, be safe. You know, everybody went in the back, locked the doors. And, uh, Call 911. Police say a group of people gathered around three Sunday afternoon. A fight broke out and shots were fired. 19 year old Tony Blunt Jr. of Columbia, who was part of that group, was also shot. The woman and her son were not involved at all. They were in a different location and they were struck, unfortunately. So what we have is a case of wrong place, wrong time. And, and it's really unfortunate, especially in the middle of the day in a village center where there's a lot of foot traffic. I'm kind of terrified considering my children play around this area. So um, it's definitely uh, a shock to me. Police are still investigating what the fight was about and who was involved. Luckily, everyone is OK. Blunt, the woman and her son were all treated and released from the hospital. But witnesses say this shooting in an area they thought was safe will be with them for a long time to come. We never expected anything like this. So this is a, a wake up call for us also <laughs> just to, you know, see who's coming in, who's around, you know, the surroundings and everything. Police say they are stepping up patrols in this area. They are also offering a $5,000 reward for information in this case. If you know anything, you want to give them a call at 410-313-STOP. Reporting live in Howard County, Kim Day, CWBAL, TV 11 News.